Hi, I'm Mike Stanton. It's August 12th. This is the BAM Weekly Muni Market Update. I'm here with Chris Flossie from BAM's Capital Markets Desk. Thanks for being here in person, Chris. Thanks, Mike. Happy to be here. Um, so we are still in this summer doldrums, a relatively light new issue calendar this week. What kind of activity did you see? Yeah, overall, we, ta- we saw a slower tone in the market. We saw lower bid wanted activity and customer buy activity. That was down by 13% versus the historical averages. Uh, competitive volume was very low this week. We only bid, here at BAM, we only bid, I think, 15 competitive sales. Usually, it's more upwards of 30 to 40. Uh, so we've definitely seen the summer take full effect over here. Uh, there was a big economic data number this week. The CPI came in a little bit lower than expected. Any reaction? Uh, munis are largely unchanged uh, for the week, but there was some treasure uh, sell off in the treasury market and that had an equity rally right off the back of that as well. So next week actually gets a little bit busier. Uh, I think the overall calendar for next week is above $10 billion, uh, closer to 11 mm-hmm. What uh, What kind of activity are you expecting? So you're right. I think the market's going to be very happy to see a larger calendar. We've seen the run rate over the past few weeks at roughly $5 billion, but with the $11 billion calendar, I think that'll be... Uh, digested very well over the market uh, through the market. Uh, the, the the calendar is heavily weighted towards larger transactions and larger issuers, but we hope to see some insurance utilization across the board. Right, and some of those giant names we're going to hear from are the uh, Commonwealth of Massachusetts has an unemployment insurance transaction. Uh, University of California will be in the market. New York City's got a nearly one billion dollar transaction. Beyond that, the the volume falls uh, somewhat lower. And the largest BAM insured transaction on the calendar at this point is for Northeast Ohio Medical University. That's a thirty million dollar transaction. Steve will be pricing in the negotiated market. So we'll see how that uh, performs and whether any other refundings or other transactions that are on the sidelines might come into the market uh, if you see more stability. Uh, Thanks for your time, Chris. Have a great weekend. Thanks, Mike. You too.